to get tighter here. It has to be. And there it is. Still life left in this game. And they have the momentum now. The wait is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from the Bernabeu here on EA TV. This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Stuart Robson. It is Manchester City versus Manchester United. Well, what a night, Derek. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium, and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? Manchester City. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Kyle Walker plays with Joao Cancelo in the fullback positions. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. This is the team Manchester United will go with. David De Gea between the posts. Christian Eriksen plays alongside Scott McTominay in midfield. And leading the attack today is Cristiano Ronaldo. This is it, the Champions League final. They are underway. Who will be crowned club kings of Europe? Ball played nicely. Losing possession. Chance to do damage, but quick thinking defensively. Jesus Jack Grealish Deft read by Ericsson Well we have to say Stuart respect and admiration grows for Kevin De Bruyne with each passing year so many attributes what are you looking for from him in this game? Well he's such a natural finisher he has everything a good goal scorer needs composure, technique and awareness he will certainly need to be tightly marked today of possibilities inside the box. Holland. Precise ball movement. He must finish. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. <laughs> Put in by De Bruyne. And a time for calm on the ball. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Holland. And return to Grealish. And in it goes! Manchester City strike first in the Champions League final. Well, here it is again. And the defending simply isn't good enough. 
They have to react quicker, deal with the danger and show more urgency. None of which they did and that's the result. United restart the game, disappointed to have conceded, can they come up with an equaliser? A really effective shielding under pressure, Ericsson, it's with McTominay, Casemiro, it needs an accurate cross, Shaw, McTominay, And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Can someone get on the end of this? It might be. An alert piece of defending. Shielding the ball superbly. Rodri. Gabriel Jesus. Really nice ball. Bernardo Silva. And the cross into the middle. Well cleared away. Casemiro. Decent position this for United to find themselves. And it's come off the keeper. Well, threat averted. De Bruyne. Grealish. Holland. Erling Holland. And somehow kept out by De Gea. And De Bruyne firing is over. Still looking to get the shot off. But they dealt with the threat first. Pressing high, and they have the ball again. Grealish. On to Holland. Gabriel Jesus. And a goal! Well, here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish. But the keeper at his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post covered for me. So, 2-0 now. Failure to keep the ball by United. Well, as the stats confirm, City have controlled the ball and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that. Now, will they be able to play it in behind the defence? Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Scott McTominay. Here's Luke Shaw. Shaw. Encouraging stuff from United. Cutting infield here. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Holland. Now with Jesus. And there to intervene.
Eriksen. Eriksen. On to Ronaldo. Eriksen. And return to Ronaldo. And the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. Kevin De Bruyne. Now Holland. Jesus. And the no-nonsense clearance. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Maguire. Diogo Dallo on the ball. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. Cristiano Ronaldo. It's with McTominay. And that is that half time here in the Spanish capital. Into the second half, then, in this battle for Champions League glory. Shaw. It's with McTominay. And they need to get tighter here. Well, here it is again. The build-up is so patient. They're just waiting to play that killer pass at the right time. But should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. So the match continues, and United just one behind here. Casemiro Here's Ronaldo Well pass after pass Maybe they can chisel an opportunity And Cristiano Ronaldo waiting Silva City moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? Space and time for the cross. Possession one. Well, there it is. United have had most of the ball, but they aren't doing enough with it. They need to pass it quicker, play forward earlier and show more energy. Otherwise, they won't get back into this one. But after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes and now both sides will make personnel switches. Shaw. Bruno Fernandes has it. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Kevin De Bruyne. On to Silva. Gabriel Jesus, brilliant save. Matic. Harry Maguire now. Casemiro. And then with a real chance. Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. Walker 
Holland. Sterling has it. He has time to play it over. Sterling. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Here's De Bruyne. Body on the line. Lisandro Martinez. Bruno Fernandes. Cristiano Ronaldo. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Twenty minutes to go. And the pass not quite accurate enough. And a throw in then. A change in the offing for City. Cristiano Ronaldo. Bruno Fernandes has it. Here's Ronaldo. Scott McTominay. More than decent this from United. A wonderful intervention. Gundogan. Now Holland. Well, City are almost there. Not quite. They can't celebrate just yet. Stuart, what have you made of their performance in this match? Well, for much of this match, they've controlled the tempo of the game and deserved their lead. But this is going to be a frantic finale. They just need to defend their box really well here. Ten minutes to go, then. Jadon Sancho. Manchester United know they've got to get on the front foot with time, the enemy. Perfect challenge. Ronaldo. Here's Casemiro. And a very good challenge. Walker. De Bruyne. Silva. An incisive pass. And he might be in here. Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. So back underway at 3 1. Casemiro could cross it in here. Effective challenge. Ruben Diaz. A message delivered from the referee to the fourth official. Three minutes on the board. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. And the keeper taking care of the situation. Sancho. Now Casemiro, Ronaldo, 
It might be on for them. Not finished yet. Not quite yet. Still excitement left in the game. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. And there it is, full-time Manchester City Champions League winners. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Manchester City. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. The Champions League victors, Manchester City.